Boeing's next division is conducting test flights of electrically powered, autonomously controlled aircraft being developed for both passenger and cargo transportation as part of an effort that it believes could transform mobility over the next decade. In January 2019, Boeing started flying its passenger air vehicle outdoors, and in May, this aircraft was joined by a cargo air vehicle. In its current design, the passenger air vehicle can carry two people up to 50 miles, and Boeing is considering a model that would carry four people. The cargo air vehicle, which had conducted several earlier indoor flights since 2018, can carry a payload of up to 500 pounds in weight. So Boeing next is really looking at what we call future mobility. If you think about what's happened digitally over time, we've become much more of a mobile society through digital mobility, like smartphones and different types of software. But what we believe the next chapter is, is about physical mobility. So how do people and goods start to move differently, especially in a time where urbanization is growing, traffic congestion is getting higher, and time is becoming more precious for people. And so that's really what's driving us from a strategic standpoint, is how do we really enhance the ability to transport both people and goods differently in the future. The passenger air vehicle has eight motors, each fitted with a two-bladed propeller. The aircraft also has a conventional fixed wing, as well as a single motor in the rear of the fuselage to power horizontal cruise flight. Lift for the cargo air vehicle is powered by six dual rotors with a total of 12 propellers. We do believe there's different use cases uh, over time for cargo and passenger, and there's uh, absolutely an area where cargo will probably be adopted first just because safety is so important in everything that we do, and making sure that we don't uh, risk any integrity to the way safety in the airspace is managed today. On June 2nd, the passenger air vehicle crashed during its fifth flight, causing some damage to the rear of the fuselage. Boeing is committed to continuing the flight test program, either with the same prototype or a replacement, and will be evaluating the transition from vertical to forward flight modes. We're currently designed to be all electric, uh, and from a sustainability standpoint and ability to give back to the environment, that's an aspect that uh, we, we think is very, very important. We're looking at higher capacity, uh, and we're looking at different propulsion options uh, alongside that as well, uh, both electric and electric hybrid battery technology, which we think will continue to improve over time. So these things will not be flying tomorrow. Uh, like I said, it's future mobility. But over, over time, you know, the ability to really change the way we travel, the passenger air vehicles could start moving people around in a number of urban environment in the next decade. The passenger air vehicle is being developed by Boeing subsidiary Aurora Flight Sciences. Boeing Next is also working in partnership with Arium to develop a new supersonic business aircraft. If you've enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, share it, and subscribe to our channel. Also, visit AINonline.com and check out our e-newsletters for all the latest on the aviation industry.